Hello everyone, welcome back to Learning Clear Exams with me. The objective of today's video is that I would like to show the question paper of Mathematical Foundation for Computer Application. Okay, well let's start. So the subject code is 20 MCA 14. The time duration is 3 hours. So let me uh, read it the uh, note. Answer 5 full questions. Choosing 1 full question from each module. Second, use of statistical table is permitted. Okay. They will be giving the statistical table or else you can confirm once with your max subject teacher. Okay. Module 1, 1A, one define a set. Okay. Define a set, empty set and a singleton set with example for each. And the ma marks carries 4 marks. 1B, define union and intersection of two sets with examples. Okay. 4 marks. Then 1C, find the eigenvalues and eigenvectors of the matrix. 12 marks. Okay. And the matrix is given over here and it is a 3 cross 3 and the 3 by 3 matrix to uh, question quarter. Right? So, eigenvalue and eigenvector you are supposed to find and straight away it carries for 12 marks. So, 4, 4, 12. Okay. Now, and then 2A. What is the cardinality of a set? Find the cardinality of the sets A and B where A is given as uh, in the set 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9. Okay. And B is given as A, E, I, O, U. Marks, 4 marks. So, 2B, a total of 1, 2, 3, 2 students have taken a course in Java. Okay. 8, 7, 9 in C and 114 have taken a course in C++. Further, 103 have taken a courses in both Java and C. Okay. 23 have taken courses in both. And uh, okay. And again, the further question continues like this. Java and C++ and 14 have taken courses in both C and C++. If 2092 students have taken at least one of Java, C and C++, how many students have taken a course in all the three subjects? Okay. 8 marks, guys. If question is not done, okay. Straight away, you can gain 8 marks. So, 2C and K are under for any three sets. Three sets bandu A, B, C. A, B, C prove that A union B whole dash, which is equal to A dash intersection B dash. And second, other than subclass, second, then under A intersection B whole dash equals to A dash union B dash. So, this is six marks. So, 2D state and explain feature null principle two marks. Okay, now. So, you know, my uh, module one, module one and module uh, one only second section not only. Either uh, either nimge one only A, B, C go to the attend maari, ila two A, B. A, B, C, D, go to the attend maari. Nimge yao question al nimge confidence ila to hariti questions al attend maari. Okay, now. So, module two, module two, three A. What is proposition? Let P and Q be the proposition. And either only swimming in the New Jersey seashore is allowed and sharks have been near the seashore. Express each of the following compound proposition as an English uh, sentence. Okay, the questions are given over here. You can check it out. And the marks is six marks. Okay, 3B, write the contrapositive, the converse and the inverse of the conditional statement if the home team wins when it's raining. Okay, 6 marks. So, 3C, show that compound proposition for this. Uh, okay, you can check it over here. Just a second, guys. Okay, which is, uh, which is uh, logically equivalent to this one. Okay. And then 4A, B, C, let me uh, read it out. Show that the following argument is valid. If today is Tuesday, I have a test in mathematics or economics. If my economics professor is sick, I will not have a test in economics. Today is Tuesday and my economics uh, professor is sick. Therefore, I have a test in mathematics. So, 8 marks. Okay, then 4B. Give the proof of the following statement. If n is an odd, odd integer, then n square is odd using the direct and indirect proof method. Very, very important. 7 marks. And C, 4C, what is the truth value of for all value x of x square uh, greater than or equals to x? And in that, if the domain consists of all real numbers, if the domain consists of all integers, 5 marks. Okay. So, module 2, 3ABC or in the module 2 itself, one more question, 4ABC. Okay. If you want, you can even take the screenshot. Well, module 3, 5ABC. Okay. Let me read it out. Let A equals to 1, 2, 3, 4. Let R equals to, okay. I'm not uh, reading out. You can check it out. B, a relation on A. Determine whether R is reflexive, symmetric, anti-symmetric or transitive. 8 marks. Okay. 5B. Give the directed graph of the relation R, which is equals to this one, on the set 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. 5C. Okay. 5C. Let R1 and R2 be the relations represented by the matrices. And the matrices is given over here. Check it out, guys. And uh, they are asking, determine R1 union R2 and R1 intersection R2. Uh, straight away R1 and straight away R2. 8 marks. Okay. It's very easy. See, if you are preparing for max, uh, no, uh, prepare from module 3. Module 3 in the new bandre so that you know it will be easy. Module 3 bandu, module 1 bani. Okay. This is my personal suggestion where, you know, last year I just went from module 3, module 1. Okay. And then uh, module 4, I think. Okay. Module 4. And then, and then mod, okay. Something. Module 2. And at last I came for module 5. Okay, this was my, you know, strategy to prepare our last year max. So, 3, 1, 4, 2, 5 was my uh, strategy. Okay, and it, it's up to you. However you want, you can, you know, prepare for the exam. 
and whichever questions are you know straight away you know uh, very well uh, do attend those question first and later on you can go for other questions andre artha ivaga nodi exam question paper bantu anta ankoli so that nimge module 3 nalli iro ella questions and sub classes ella gotu ankoli straight away adanna attend maadi then you can come for module 1 adagmel module 1 agmel nimge enadru like module 2 gotu ankoli you can come and then module 4 and then module 5 so nimge confidence irbeku yavade yavade question thumba chanda gotu avadanella starting barire solpa gottilladella kade gaaki okay na so 6ab nalli Uh, discuss uh, discuss briefly on partition and equivalence classes eight marks and draw the as uh, diagram representing the partial ordering that is a a comma b which di divided by uh, a or divides b on the given one two three four six eight twelve okay twelve marks guys so module for seven a and b a random variable x has the following probability distribution and x is uh, x value that is given as zero one two three four five six okay uh, it is in the table structure I hope you can you know understand or let me draw like this. Like this, it will be, guys. I hope you can understand. Okay, find the k value. Uh, evaluate uh, p or p in that x lesser than four, p of uh, x greater than or equals to five, and p of three lesser than x lesser than or equals to six. Okay, and third uh, sub clause under the seventh question, it is find the minimum value of x so that you know p of x lesser than or equals to two and greater than zero point three. Love and marks, guys. Okay, love and marks. Aram agi iriti question ni bo. ಕಳಿಸಬಹುದು ಓಕೆ ನಾ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಹೆಂಗ ಗೊತ್ತಾ ನೀವು ಅದನ್ನ ಅಯ್ಯೋ ನನ್ನ ಕಷ್ಟ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಅಂತ ಅನ್ಕೊಂಡ್ರೆ ಅದು ಕಡೆ ವರ್ಗ ಕಷ್ಟ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಅದನ್ನ ನೀವು ಒಂದು ಬುಕ್ ಎತ್ಕೊಂಡು ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡ್ತಾ ಬನ್ನಿ ಸೋ ದಟ್ ಯು ನೋ ಯು ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಫೈಂಡ್ ಗುಡ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಇನ್ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಫೆಚಿಂಗ್ ಗುಡ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋದು ಎಷ್ಟು ನಿಮಗೆ ಮ್ಯಾಕ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನೋ ಸಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ತುಂಬಾ ಇಷ್ಟ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಅದು ಏನಂತಾರೆ ಅಷ್ಟು ನೀವು ಚೆನ್ನಾಗಿ ಸಾಲ್ವ್ ಮಾಡಬಹುದು ಓಕೆನಾ 7b the probability okay the probability that a pen manufactured by a company will be defective 1 by 10 okay if 12 such pens are manufactured find the probability that is uh, 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 that in that first class exactly 2 will be defective see straight away they are asking exactly 2 will be defective second class under that at least 2 will be defective okay and third is none will be defective so 9 marks so in this question module 4 okay it's very easy see haram sir you can score 11 and 9 marks okay 8a and the maximum you just involve agbeku so that you know adai munche heltane olle marks galistira Eight for the probability density function f of x, where f of x equals to okay, uh, check this condition, guys. I'm not going to read six marks. So find f of x and use it to evaluate p of zero lesser than x lesser than or equal to one. So eight b the probability that a patient recovers from a rare blood disease is zero point four. Okay, if if fifteen people are known to have contracted the disease, what is the probability that at least ten survive? Okay, next is from three to eight survive. Third is Exactly five survive. Okay, this is nine marks and eight uh, C. Given a standard normal distribution, find the value of x. Okay, such that p of z greater than uh, x, which is equals to zero point three zero one five, and second is p of x lesser than z less than uh, less than minus zero point one eight, which is equals to zero point four one nine two. Okay, five marks. So next comes the module five. Okay, e on the module nalo no, ani wo score chana ngar bo toh. Okay na. Nine. Define the following with suitable examples. Three times they are asking simple graph and random. Define mali. I I naalku graph nali. Ena naite adu you know definition bari the one example kori. Aste six marks. Simple graph. Complete graph. By partitioned graph. Then complete by partitioned graph. Okay. This is six marks. Then uh, B. Check whether the following two graphs are isomorphic with each other. Six six marks. Okay. Check the graph guys. And then C. It is explain points per bridge problem. Eight marks. I don't know. Chana kira the. Okay. Na points per ko. On the story agu ni vata mar kolbo do. So that uh, Aksmat pe na dhu ni exam ko prepare agi lande ni points per bridge bage ondo. Ena tore ondo naalik sampad ne mar kola kadru. I points per bridge bage til kolu. Okay na. And ten uh, ne define the terms. Uh, that is Hamilton path, Euler's path, planar graph. And fourth is sub graph of a graph with suitable example for each. Okay. Six marks. Then B. Uh, given the graph coloring of the graph shown in the figure. Okay. In the figure they are shown. Okay, give me this. Okay, then ten C use. Uh, sorry. Use Biskestra's algorithm to find the length of a shortest path between the vertices A and Z uh, in the graph given below, and the uh, and the graph is given this, and this is ten marks. Okay, if you want, you can take the screenshot, or else you can even download the question paper from the Google, from the internet. Okay, this is the total objective of today's video. I hope this video was useful, and do subscribe to our channel so that in upcoming days you will be getting more information about MCA. Okay, all. Bye. Let's meet in another video.